Hello chess friends, welcome to Alpha Zero vs Stockfish 16 beta episode. I will cover the game, and teach you some chess strategies. If you want a historical chess game or CGC game reply or any Grandmasters exciting game like Magnus or Kasparov, then you can comment me, I will check the game. And if you haven't subscribed our channel yet, then you can subscribe to reach me 50k subscribers, subscribe the channel or please, give a like to the video, it's enough for me. Better fish starts with e4, c5, knight goes to f3. d6. d4, we have c takes d4, knight captures on d4. You can play e5, knight f6 or knight c6, alpha chooses to play knight f6, popular line, fish played knight c3. a6, try to protect the b5 square, and preparing for b5, b4 for the future. He can play queen c7, and knight c6, so, we have bishop e2. Knight d7, fish played bishop e3. g6, queen up to d2, well his strategy is to castle long. No, it's not right move, because the c-file is open for black, and he will push the pawns if I do castle long, so, queen and bishop making a bishop pair to eliminate the dark square bishop if needed. So, alpha 0 played b5, a4 by fishy. Pushing the b-pawn is not good, because of this, if he takes the e4 pawn, then queen takes b4. White have some advantages of of bc pawns, he will push the pawns, then make a pass pawn on c-file. For that reason, alpha played b takes a4. f3. Bishop g7, knight captures on a4, bishop b7 by alpha, white's strategy is, he will push the bc pawn, takes, takes and play like this, where he have passed pawn. So, c4. a5, we have short castle. Short castle, rook up to a3, knight goes to c5. Rook f a1, knight rotates on d7, knight captures on c5. D takes c5, we have knight b3, rook a6 by alpha 0, he want to put the rook on d6. So, knight takes a5, targeting the bishop, if queen c7, try to protect the bishop with a piece develop, then knight takes bishop, rook takes, rook takes rook, queen takes b7, rook d3. Knight e5, and rook d5, targeting the pawn potentially. White have advantages because he have bishop pair and he will make a passed pawn. So, in this position, alpha played bishop c8, we have knight b3. Rook b6, bishop f1 by fishy. Queen c7. Bishop f4. Alpha 0 played knight e5, but best was to play bishop e5, anyway, we have queen f2, targeting the pawn with queen and knight. f5. E takes f5, rook takes on f5, bishop, back to g3. h5. h3. Queen d6. Rook b1, rook goes to b4, knight captures on b5, we have h4. Bishop takes e5, bishop takes e5, threatening to play bishop d4, try to pin the queen to the king. So, knight e4, we have queen d4. Rook a8, rook back to f8. b3? Bishop f5, fishy played rook takes rook. King takes f8. Bishop e2, king goes to f7. Queen takes d4, bishop captures on d4. King f1. Bishop takes e4, f captures on e4. e6, fishy played bishop, d1, King comes on f6. King e2. King e7. King d3, we have e5. King e2, rook back to b8. b4. Bishop c5, you can't take the bishop, because of this, so, b5. Chess friends, let me put your brain power improving piano music, enjoy.
Thanks for watching, subscribe for more. Bye bye, take care, see you in my next video.